precise skyline presents, David steals the Berenstain Bears family car slash arrested slash grounded. Why is my only purpose to read the titles of your boring videos, though? Money. That's why. Boredom is a bitch, isn't it? There's nothing to do because I am still grounded for disrespecting the death of Queen Elizabeth. What could I do and not let my stupid parents find out about? I got it, I got it, I got it. I will steal the Baron Stainbearer's family car and take it for a small joyride around town. Though I didn't think about the fact that I would have to walk 14 kilometers just to get to it. Oh well, I might as well do it now then, no use in waiting around. Well, no going back now. Let's hop in. What the heck? I thought I parked the car here the last time we went shopping. I think I know who it was, it was David. I'll go inside and tell Papa Bear to contact the police. Contact the police Papa Bear, our car has been stolen. I am on it Mama Bear. I am surprised this thing can go 100 miles per hour. Oh shit, the cops are on to me. We are on the tail of a perp driving a Chevrolet Volt. You are putting people's lives at risk. Pull over now. That didn't work to stop the cops. I said pull over you dimwit. That failed to stop him. Patrol. Copy. That perp was last seen heading westbound in Montgomery Gardens. This is patrol. We will be here on standby if needed. Pull the damn vehicle over or I will run you off the road. Last warning loser. Pull over right now. This perp is still going. I gotta get these 5-0 off my tail. Oh no, I am going to run out of battery charge. Out of the vehicle right now. Hands up, turn around right now and put your hands behind your back. As of this moment, you are under arrest for grand theft auto and reckless endangerment. You will not have to say anything, however, if questioned about something, you may harm your defense if you don't. Anything you say can be also used against you in a court of law. Now, step inside the police car right now. I warmed up the back seat for a thieving criminal like you. This sucks. I can't believe I am in prison now. Well, you have some visitors who want to see you, kid. Uh, mom, uh, hello, mom and dad. Are you here to bail me out along with Stephanie? My name is Veronica, thank you. And we are beyond pissed at you right now, especially after you decided to steal the Berenstain Bears family car. That is something that we worked our butts off for, and now we have to pay a massive fee to get the scratches and dents, which although small, repaired. You are nothing more than truly selfish David Andrew Harrison. I never thought that I would ever say this to anyone's child, but you and your future are truly doomed. There's just no other way to put it. We have given you so many chances, David. We have given so much, and all you do is treat us like we're punching bags, toys. What is this nonsense? I don't know you too well, but I do not like you. Not with a single bone in my body. I absolutely agree with Brother Bear. We just can't put our anger into words. So here's what's going to happen from here on out. You will be grounded for an additional five months on top of the time you've been grounded for not only disrespecting the death of Queen Elizabeth but also misbehaving at your cousin's house. And even when your grounding is lifted, new rules will be going into effect in our house. You will not be allowed to leave the house unless we give you clear explicit permission until you are 18. We will also be monitoring you at home a lot more frequently as well. This will be to ensure you do not cause any more trouble. If you cause trouble, harsher punishments than groundings will be enacted. Is all of what we're saying clear? Yes mom and dad, loud and clear. Good, now, let's all go home and enjoy our evenings. And David, before we go, we want you to reflect on your behavior while you're here. <laughs>